Many of my viewers are confused and they are asking me to provide the link for this game. It's very simple. You can download it from Play Store or if you are using an iPhone, you can download it from App Store. Just go to Play Store, type here FIFA Mobile. Click on it and you will get the game. Here it is. So here is my graphic setting, it's on ultra, resolution is high, frame rate 60 fps and rest everything is on high. By the way I'm using Samsung Galaxy S22 Plus mobile, 8GB RAM and Snapdragon 8 Gen Plus 1 chipset. Also from here, you can download all the commentary available, Arabic, Chinese, English, French, German. For now, I have downloaded English, which is 420 MB. Let's play. Hello, excitement in the air, and welcome to this round of 16 contest here at the 2022 World Cup. My name is Derek Ray, and alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building up, what a game this promises to be. It's Argentina against Denmark. Well, the hosts certainly go into this game as strong favourites. They have better technical players and can be brilliant when everything clicks. But their opponents are well-organised, resilient, and pose a threat on the counter-attack. Therefore, an early goal will be the main priority for the home team. Messi. Lo Celso. Rodrigo de Paul. It's with Paredes. Cleared away comprehensively. Mikael Damsgaard, very quick thinking there. Martinez. Lionel Messi. Lo Celso. Moving forward effectively. And can they make one of these passes count? Can they forge ahead? Oh. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. Gives it a go. Right here. Skolva Olsen. Eriksson. Kasper Dolberg. Well, they keep passing away. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Martinez. Showing a real will to win the ball. Delaney. Is it going to be? Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. 
that's a great save. And it's Robinho throwing for Denmark. Di Maria. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Would the club secretary please go to Mr. Moon? Is in the building. Oh no. Decided to make a change. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. So, back in business here, the first period of extra time, and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? Let's make it to penalty shootout. Papu Gomez. Di Maria. Martinez. Oh, a powerful effort. Close. Gomez. Dybala. Messi. Papu Gomez. Back to Dybala. And with that, can he finish? And a goal! Just when we wondered if this might finish nil nil. There it is. They're in front. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Now back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. And there we have it. The referee brings this game to an end. Argentina has made it through to the last stage. Well, there's going to be some tired legs tonight. It was so evenly contested, certainly over the 90 minutes. But they just had that little bit of it. It's offside, and perhaps he should have been a bit more alert. And maybe a little bit more aware in the box. He was just too static. Now where is Molina? Time is fast running out. Five minutes left of the second period of extra time here. Martinez. Oh, fine save. And it remains all square. Well, he saved his team there. That's a big moment for the keeper. It always had the potential to go the So distance. finally, we have penalty shootout in semi final. It is all about the penalty shootout. Oh, brilliant Shit. goalkeeping. His turn to try to convert from the spot. And confidently converts it. And the penalty yes. converts. to take the shot and he's taken the low road beautifully done composure is so important under these trying circumstances and there it is perfectly executed Yeah. 